This lustrous stoneware vessel is a ewer, or pitcher, dating to the early 1100s during the Goryeo dynasty. It was probably used for wine, which may have been warmed by placing the ewer in a matching bowl of warm water. This ewer's cylindrical body, sharp-angled flat shoulder, and looping flat handle seems to emulate a metal vessel. The lid takes the form of a double lotus with a jewel element on top. Mark Fenn, Associate Head of Conservation, has taken a close look at this ewer. It's in pretty good shape. There's a few scratches here and there. The knob on the very top of the lid is a replacement. It was broken off at one point and it's been rebuilt and repainted so that it blends in very nicely. And of course, there is the ewer's exquisite color. This ewer is glazed with a color called celadon, which is caused by iron oxide in the glaze. And it's fired in a reducing atmosphere, which means that there's no oxygen present in the kiln during the firing. If there'd been oxygen in the kiln, it would have come out red. Believed to have first been made in the second half of the 9th century, celadon has always been highly valued. In 1123, an emissary from the Chinese imperial court praised its forms and jade-colored glaze. In the 13th century, celadon was regarded as the first under heaven. Today, connoisseurs around the world continue to treasure celadons from this period as among the most precious items created by Korean artisans.